Zoe Ball has broken her silence on being BBC's highest paid woman. The Radio 2 breakfast host, 51, is on a healthy £980,000, which is a drop from her £1. 13 million earnings in 2021. The former at Takes Two presenter is the second highest earning star, with match of the day's Gary Lineker taking the top spot. But Zoe says while she is one of the BBC's top earners, she doesn't take her position for granted after the radio network announced a huge shakeup earlier this year. Much-loved host Steve Wright was axed after 23 years while Paul O'Grady stepped down after 14 years. Speaking about having her salary published, Zoe said, I don't think it's something I want to whine on about too much at the moment, people are going through a tough old time. It's never an easy thing to discuss, but it's part of the job. And I'm very grateful. Despite being at the top of the list of BBC's highest earners, the television star admitted she doesn't take it for granted and doesn't feel like it means she is safe for a cull. I'm not going anywhere yet that I know of. You're only one sentence away from being cancelled, of course. That's what I always say to Greg James, I've not been cancelled today. So I'm there at the moment, fingers crossed. It's such a great job and I always feel like I will do a job for as long as I'm happy, she told this week's Radio Times. During the interview, Zoe spoke about Steve's departure in the shake-up. The radio host said he was like a godfather to her and his replacement, Scott Mills will have big shoes to fill. Zoe said she understands the listeners don't always like change but thinks Scott will be amazing, adding she felt Steve's final show was masterfully done. Scott will launch his new weekday afternoon show, taking over from Steve Wright who broadcast his last show last week after 23 years on the airwaves. Resident BBC DJ Scott left Radio 1 after 24 years last month. He will launch his new afternoon show on Halloween. Ahead of his new show's launch, Scott said Hess looking forward to his brand new era in his new home. He explained, in an attempt to scare me even more, the bosses have decided my very first show is on Halloween. Join me every day for the best music and let's switch off from the world for a couple of hours and have a laugh. Owain Wynne Evans has been announced as the presenter for the early breakfast show, replacing Vanessa Feltz, and will start in January. The show will be broadcast from the BBC Cymru Wales Broadcast Centre in Cardiff as the first Radio 2 show to move out of London in part of the Beebs Across the UK plan, allowing the broadcaster to better reflect, represent and serve all parts of the country. Paul announced he was leaving his show after 14 years in August in news which devastated his fans. He was not alone in jumping ship. In the shake-up, celebrity Big Brother star Vanessa Feltz quit, leaving both her Radio 2 Early Breakfast and her BBC Radio London Breakfast show, 7am to 10am, after nearly 20 years. Craig Charles House Party which aired on Saturdays from 10 p.m. midnight, has also been axed after the Red Dwarf star presented it since 2014. Scissor Sisters star Animatronics Early Hours Sunday Show Dance Devotion and Dr. Ongon Chatterjee's Late Night Sunday Show were also on the chopping block.